Atreus wants to anger bone ya. Ha! Get, uh, he never saw the slate that has Kratos dying. But he's about to. Thor killing Kratos and then Atreus joining Odin. Oh! That was fucking sick. Summon y Yala, you just go, Hoya! That's what she's saying. She's saying, Hoya! What is going on, YouTube Universe? This is Zero back again with another installment of God of War Ragnarok. Sit back, relax, it is game time. Look at these little dudes. Can I kill them? No, I can't. Fuck, I love the little creatures in this game. Speaking of, our squirrel friend wants to have a chat. We are back from Alfheim, by the way. Um, if you missed the happenings of Alfheim, go check the playlist linked in the description. But long story short... Uh, Tia doesn't want to fight this war. I think he's over war altogether. Atreus sensed there was a creature hurt in the desert and we freed it. And I managed to get a brand new armor set by checking out the desert on my way back to Sindri's house. But we'll, we'll check the armor set out momentarily because I want to talk to our little squirrel boy. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes, and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. Well then, what else, friends? I have a question. Splendid! I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons? Oh no, young master Atreus. Those are lean worms, the brood of Neithog. Neithog? That's the mother? Correct. She's also a vital piece of the Yggdrasilian circle of life, as it were. I tend the branches up here, while Neithog chews the roots from below to prevent overgrowth. A delicate balance. So they're friendly? Well, they're not nearly so affable as myself, but there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace. Neithog is a stern matriarch, as protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds familiar. Hmm. Mm. Sounds like Kratos. Until our next encounter, then. Speaking of Kratos, I need to show you. Oh, we we need to check out this armor. Let's have a look. So it's the Radiance armor, um, all of which apparently radi radiate the light of Alfheim. Oh yeah. Have a look at the jump. We're wearing the Spalders of Enlightenment at level 3. And it gives us 12 strength, 20 defense, 20 runic. Shoulder straps give us 34 strength, 20 defense. It drops our runic down to 17, but our luck goes to 17. I love that. Wrist armor. Gauntlets of Radiance. Yes. Strength goes from 20 to 28. Thank you. And the waist armor. Oh, hell yeah. 20 to 28 on defense, but the main thing, fucking, he looks very, the, the armor looks very reptilian, and my name's Zira, so it makes fucking sense. Now, Atreus has another accessory, lethal detonation, enemies killed from a runic arrow explode, dealing moderate damage around them. I can dig that. Fucking love that look on Kratos. I'm very happy I found those armor pieces. There was only one armor piece that we didn't oh, capture yeah, on camera. Um, so I'm happy about that. Oh. I just want to see here. To find we need more dwarven steel in order to upgrade. We can upgrade the gauntlets, which I am going to do. Strength up to 36. Hell yes. We're going to be delivering some big fucking punches now, ladies and gentlemen. I never said that. You're kind that way. But your eyes say everything. Dress. And this is the long table that uh, Sindri said he'd help build, so now we can all sit at the table properly. Oh, 
Careful. Careful. Thank you. Tia's now taken up the position of cooking. I wonder what Brock's going to say about it. Enjoy. Enjoy, my friends. Yeah. We'll see about that. Let's see. Here you are. A meal fit for a champion. Enough. I said we would speak no more of that. Yes, of course. Didn't mean to offend. Uh, I'm not offended. It's just a word. The word didn't cloud your judgment. So, you really don't think it means anything? After the journey Mom sent us on? Everything we saw in Jotunheim? What was it all for? Don't you ever think about that? Every day. But I cannot believe her purpose was to inspire you to take foolish risks. Well, what if the giants are counting on me? What giants? I am counting on you. To be safe. To be smart. But Use the judgment of a man and not of a child. But what if Loki going to Ironwood is the only way that... Ah, oh, Atreus. My son. And nothing more. Do you hear me? Kratos has fucking had enough. I'm not hungry anymore. Gonna go have a sook in your bedroom, huh? My words were chosen carelessly. So you're gonna, you really should eat. You're gonna jump out the window? Some people swear by it. On almost a daily basis. I just don't understand. Why is there all this stuff about Loki and, and the champion and Ironwood if none of it's real? He's just so... Ugh! Mind if I give you the best advice you've heard all day, and possibly ever? Sleep. That's when all the troubles of your mind work themselves out. Sure. Fine. Sleep? Sounds great. I mean it. I do too. Get out of here, Heidi. Already gone. Was he holding his hand out because he touched someone and he doesn't like germs and stuff? That. Sindri, come on now. going on here we're about to find out what are you? I wish I'd known I was a god in Alphon I wouldn't have felt so bad about killing so many elves what's going on is that a mask I mean just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Where am I? It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Do something about it or shut up right. Little people's little we're problems. We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems. 
memories and not nice ones. You broke the gate! That was our only way to Yonahan! What do you want? Let's go! Yuma! I don't understand! Whatever. 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 Hey! Whatever. Don't run off! Whatever. Whatever. Can you tell me where I am? This is trippy as fuck. Whatever, 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 whatever. Will you stop? I gotta get out of here. Say that again. better knife than mother's. Please stop! My spirit animal. Okay, guess I'll see you around the other side. Look how beautiful the world is! Oh, little creatures! Where am I? Can you understand me? Another wolf. Oh. Hi there. So. Where are we going? <coughs> Got it. I was having the weirdest dream and just kind of woke up here. Is this Ironwood? <coughs> Any idea how I got here? <coughs> I dreamt my way here? I mean, suppose I must have. I'm here. <coughs> Strange that he'd go there in a dream. What scent? Oh, that might be Fenrir you're smelling. Given Mamiya turned around and said that uh, this place is nothing but, you know, fairy tale, basically. <laughs> There's a lot of you, huh? What's that? We're joining like? the wolf pack. The air here, it's. I don't know. Sweeter? Maybe it's these trees. Be right there. Ah. Ah. <laughs> you tell me if you were going to eat me. <laughs> That's a joke, right? Where are you all taking me? I've never seen a forest like this before. I wonder whether he's going to shift into a wolf because we know Atreus uh, can shape shift because at the start of the series he uh, he shifted into a bear. So now that we're linking up with all these wolves, is he going to shift into a wolf? Because that'll be dope as fuck.
This game is stunning. Someone's been painting. I'm not finished with it yet. That's exactly what the painting just depicted. The paint is made from the bark of the ironwood trees. They absorb the memories of the forest so that the paint remembers too. Memories of the past. Ironwood trees of the future. They absorb the memories of the forest so that the paint remembers too. Memories of the past. I'd hate to get blood on. Of the future. I'd hate to get blood on it. Oh, it's really you. Uh, you know who I am? Oh, What's it's wrong? Really I thought you'd be taller. I've been waiting my whole life for this moment. Weirder than I imagined. Oh. Sorry. Um. Was that mean? Kind of. Damn it. I'm already messing this up. <laughs> it's just you're the first person that I've talked to in a very long time. And weird can be good. Weird is very good. Thanks. I'd rather be weird than normal. Let's start over. I'm Angaboda. Angaboda. You must have a lot of questions. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. Where Follow are me. We? You'll get your answers soon enough. Well, some of them. Wonder whether Atreus wants to Angabonia. Ha! Uh, you you we well, have discovered Ironwood, ladies that. and gentlemen. You'll get your answer soon enough, will you? Uh, right. Is that not your name? No. It is my name. When you said you knew me. Oh. Like I said, you'll get your answer soon enough, will you? Oh. Right. I'll, uh, right. Take my own path. <laughs> so where am I exactly? I'm in this weird fog. Oh, I've heard the Utengard can be disorienting. Still, so, you're safe here in the island. <gasps> so I thought if Ironwood wasn't a real place. She's okay, here. Right? Does that mean Anyone she's a giant or a child of a giant as well? The forest of the giants. That's what some people call it. I can't check out down there, obviously. Um, nothing checked down there either. I want to cover all bases. Approach. It's big. Compared to? I thought giants were all supposed to be giant. So, what do you do here? Paint, forage, survive. Preserve what I can. But why wait for me? Because my destiny is to tell you yours. Woo! Watch, Watch out! out! Good night. Fuck yes! This is what I'm talking about! 
Hang back, big damage. So, what were you doing before you came here? Surviving Fimble Winter. Wait, is that a thing around here? Did you know about it? I did. I'll be up above you, but keep going the way you're going. Okay. <laughs> is that chainmail? These overworlds, man. Oh, Could they be any more beautiful? Kind of? <laughs> you make our giants are strange. They're dwarves, actually. Still strange. Can't believe there are nightmares there too. <laughs> Up we go. something my father you know what never mind be awesome Where'd you go? Looking good. Thanks. Wait, what? It looks like you're going the right way. Oh, yeah, totally. How are you doing? I'm great. I met another living giant. Here we go. What's in here? Maybe one who holds my destiny. What? Uh, sorry. I'm just really excited to talk to Runic you. Runic summon. Summons a spectral okay. Ibex to ride and charge into enemies. It's time. I was wondering when we'd get involved with the summons again. Everything's okay, right? Yeah. I'm just in a magical force that shouldn't exist. It's talking to another giant and she's... <laughs> Whoa, gotcha. Thank you. Thanks. Guess I'm still getting the hang of things here. <laughs> you saved my life. Where are we going? My mother recorded her visions or prophecies. Thought you might like to see them. Where are your parents? Maybe dope if I could. What's up here? Hey, I know you have a lot of questions, but not Okay. I'm sorry. Loki! Whoa! I've got it. Tell me when. Now! We make a good team, Mangaboda. Thanks. Uh, you too. <laughs> Help me with this? Oh, sure. Hang on. Okay, now you. Medallion. It's a big fucking medallion. <laughs> what? Go! Uh, okay. 
She fast as hell. I'm winning, bitch. She fucking cheated. She fucking cheated. my mom's shrines where she chronicled Groa's visions. It was her way of ensuring the legacy of our people would live on, despite the Aesir's best efforts. Where do we go now? Here. Use your magic to lift those boulders, please. I know you can. Oh, yeah. Isn't that your magic? Where do you think they learned it from? Here we are. Do you live here? Mm-hmm. This way. Wait, is this my shrine? I've been wanting to see it again. From oh there, no, he never saw the end fucking... Ready? Of course? Yeah. Others see the I'm future ready. and get... Messed up. He never saw the slate that has Kratos dying. <laughs> but he's about to... Seen this before. Where we scattered Mother's ashes. It was on the wall. Everything had happened just the way it said. This part was damaged. Oh, that's us. It's in the bag. Huh. Wonder who he is. Wait. There it is. No. No. And is that Thor? It's not right. That's Thor. I can't see what happens. No. No, no. Thor killing Kratos and then Atreus joining Odin. It's not real. The Ungar's not real. None of this is real. Oh! Hey, hey. hey. That was fucking sick. Hey, hey, calm down. Calm down. It's fine. Just breathe. Hey, hey, breathe. Good. That's good. See, it's okay. Let go. It's okay. You're fine. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened. No, don't worry about it. It happens to everyone. That happens to everyone? 
Not the wolf part, but getting scared about your future. That cannot be my future. It says I serve Odin and my father dies. There's just no way. Look, this is the only way things turn out. The sooner you accept that, the better. That's hard to accept. Oh, shit, I was mean to. Look. Just forget about that now. Forget the future. Forget Loki. You're a giant. And you're clearly coming into some powers that you don't understand yet. You think that's that's the case? Come on, let's take a walk. You can help me with something and I'll teach you. You know. Giant stuff. A grizzly bear and now a wolf, that's yeah. fucking sick. I can only hope, uh, now that we're controlling Atreus, that he turns and we can actually use him in combat, in animal form. What's this? Here, follow me. Where are we going? What are we feeding? We're going to get some food, plant some seeds, my everyday stuff. But first, I want you to meet someone. Who, who are we... Meet Yala. Hi, Yala. Uh, nice to meet you. Oh, wow. She, she's a big girl, huh? I'll give you a pet. Come on up. Good girl. Ganga. So, um, I guess you know about the whole champion of the... Jotnar? Yeah. Do you want me to call you that instead? No. Loki's good. Sure. Champ. Yeah. <laughs> Just don't let my father hear you calling me Loki because he'll lose his shit. Oh, hello, friend. Got it. Those wolves. You take care of them? I do. They're good friends. Can't wait to meet more of them. I didn't think today that uh, when we started recording, How many more we would uh, be on yak no, back just, in a beautiful swamp with all these creatures, like collecting fruit, okay. and fucking turning time. into wolf and so much shit going on. Summon Yala, Yala, you just go, Hoya! That's what she's saying. She's saying, Hoya! If I don't, they'll die. It just seems like a lot for someone your age. Our age. Huh. Right. One of the last conversations I had with my father. Oh, beautiful. He said he was sorry he couldn't protect me. That I'd have to grow up so fast. At least you got an apology. Dads have a way with words, huh? You know, maybe Oda needs you for something. Or, maybe it's not what it looks like. Maybe I'm tricking Odin. Oh, is trickery something you're good at? I lied to my dad a couple times. Oh, a master of deception. Yes. Am I supposed to ride Yala further up? <laughs> oh, you're fucking kidding me. Green bulbs go here in this bucket. Hey, if I need to, like, fix my bow or something, can I... Of course. I've got supplies in my tool chest over there. By the way, I left something in the tool chest for you. I'll meet you over by Yala when you want to leave. Is it okay to hang out around here? What did you leave in here? Champion Gob.
And a bow. Okay. Beautiful. We'll wear that because it's going to throw Kratos into a fucking fit when it goes down. Ladies and gentlemen, perfect time to end this episode. When we return, we'll uh, continue learning about Ironwood and then uh, probably return home and get scolded by Daddy again. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, do myself a favor, hit that like button down below. Be sure to subscribe if you're new around here. And as I said at the top of the video, playlist is linked in the description. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here, and as always, I will catch you guys next time.